Hey, how you doing today? My name is Rillian. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today, I want to do an updated video on how to mod Hollow Knight, and this is going to be for anybody who's been having issues with the most updated version of Hollow Knight and the mods just kind of not working for you. So when you open up the game, the first thing that we need to do is take a look at what version of Hollow Knight you have. So just open up the game. That's probably gonna be the easiest way to do it. And then look over here on uh, the bottom left of the screen. This one says 1 1.5 and the rest of the numbers don't really matter. It's just 1.5, which is the most current version of the game. So right now, if I go to mods, I go to the mod installer too and I open this bad boy up. You can see that I do have some mods on, like additional maps is on there, bench warp is on, uh, let's see, debug mod is on, that's like a big one that you use for almost everything between debug mod and bench warp, those two are like super important. Um, you can see we've got mods in here, right? But when we go to ahead and launch the game, and now the game doesn't wanna launch. See that? It's just flat out not working. See that? The little Hollow Knight utility, that little thing that popped up? It's basically a problem with the mods that we have installed. It's not going to run the game at all, period. So let's go ahead and start all the way from the beginning. If you don't even have mods at all, the first thing you need to do is go over to Discord and go to... I've got a Discord, but you don't need to go to my Discord. You need to go to the Hollow Knight Discord. And from here, they've got modding help. And they have right here the pinned comments up at the top pinned messages and this is the current mod supported for patch 1.5 so right now i'm showing you how to use the mod installer one or mod installer two i've been using mod installer two because mod installer one broke for me at some point i don't remember why or how but you just click on here come over here and then you go download whichever one you need so you can go to windows if you have windows and as soon as you click on that button it starts to save file so I already have it, but I'll just show you, you just download it, You it comes in as a zip file, you'll save it to wherever it is that you need to, wherever you want to, whether it's a desktop or, or some sort of folder. So I've got a mods folder, and I put it right here. So then when I open this bad boy, this is where all of the mods are. And so to get a mod, you would click on the you would click on the install and then click over here to enable each mod. So you can have a lot more mods installed, but they're not all necessarily on. This puts the mod on your computer, and then this row on the left turns the mod on so you're actually using it, right? So you can also close out of this whenever you're uh, not using mods. Um, but the thing that was uh, causing us issues just a second ago is we need to down patch. And it also says in here, always check if you're having issues, check the mod installer. Like it even says in here, note, if you want to use patch 1.4.3.2 installer, you must down patch your game to patch 1.4.3.2. And it even tells you right here uh, some, some important information. So go ahead, read that if you need to. The easy the the short way to do it is you right click on Hollow Knight, you go to properties, go to betas, and then from this drop down, we'll go to 1.4.3.2. Just like that. And then as you can see right here, it's gonna update. So we'll close this. We're gonna wait for that to install or update. Pretty quick, not too bad. And so now when we go ahead and play the game, we should be able to play it with all of those mods and everything. So let's go ahead and hit play. The game's launching just fine now where it wasn't before. It was, it was having a problem. It can't do the 1.5 with the mods already installed. The other problem that people might see is that it might say you must use the latest version of Hollow Knight to use those mods. It's because that mod installer thinks that 1.4.3.2 is the latest version of Hollow Knight and it's just broken with 1.5. All right, so you might have noticed that up there, uh, a bunch of text just showed up. It's because I had to reset up the modding API. Um, and so now you can see, that's how you know that your mods are working, or at least they're they're on, is that they will show up here in the top left part of the screen when you're at the main menu. So now if I go to a new game, look at this, I've got a, a randomizer mod turned on, so I can now create random maps, random grubs, and so on and so forth. Um, so that's how I would do that. Um, 
Other than that, I will leave some extra information down in the description below for like where you'd find your mod folder in case you want to manually install mods for one reason or another. I hope that you found this helpful. There is another mod installer, like I was saying. Um, one, if you come over here, back to the Hollow Knight Discord modding help section, um, there, there's all of these different installers. So what we did is this was for the mod installer one and two. If you don't want to down patch your game, there's another installer called the Scarab. And so if you download this, this will work for the 1.5 patch of Hollow Knight. And I'm really curious to see what's different as far as what mods work on that one and aren't available on the 1.4.3.2. Anyways, I hope that you found this video helpful. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I'll talk to you again more real soon. Thanks.